Good, good. And you can sit down again. Hope Within and I started about 11 years ago. I was um, laid off and I had a uh, blood clot that I didn't know about from an old injury. If I hadn't been here, I wouldn't be here now doing this because I most likely would, that would have killed me. Hope Within is a, a free primary care medical facility and that's how it started back in 2006. Um, we see patients that are financially eligible from Lancaster, Dauphin, and Lebanon counties. Um, we have a pool of volunteer medical providers who work full-time somewhere else, some at Hershey, Norlanco, Philhaven even. It's definitely an investment that will bring great returns. I, I, I feel good about coming um, and feel refreshed after I leave and feeling that I'm helping those individuals that are Some of these individuals um, cannot see their providers just because of the cost of health care. Some may not have um, workplace work right now and, and they're kind of left in the lurch at times. But fortunately, um, this organization can provide the needs for those individuals. They would not know where they would be if we weren't here. That's something that we hear time and time again. Our goal is always, when possible, to, to move them from here and get them onto medical assistance. So we do have a health care navigator who volunteers her time because we want to get them into a medical home. One of the women who is a short term who came in this year, she had no insurance because her job stopped and she was just stuck. She was having blood pressure issues and some other health issues and couldn't afford her medicines. She saw a provider several, several times, got her blood pressure down, got her medications, and she's now employed, has insurance, and is working as a volunteer for us because she was so thrilled with what we did. And now she's part of our team. That's our goal, to provide the bridge, to, to get them from here to there. Um, whether it's through their employer, whether it's through the marketplace, or medical assistance. Since COVID, we have been able to add additional medical providers. We are now up to about 15 or 16 volunteer medical providers. We've just added um, also a psychiatrist to our mental health, and a board-certified OBGYN is now available to us. Um, the dental was able to open in July, and since then we've seen over 100 patients. And the mental health has grown exponentially due to the impact of COVID. We do an oral cancer screening, um, check their gum tissues, do a regular cleaning and exam, and then uh, just go over everything, anything they would need done uh, dental-wise as far as cavities, extractions and then send that to the dentist so that she can review everything and then she comes in and um, she'll do any of the dental work that needs done that's above and beyond the cleanings. You know, I've just been blessed. God has blessed me over the years and I'm in a position now where I felt like I needed to give back, but um, I find that when I come in and I see the patients, I feel like they're blessing me more than I'm blessing them. It's just been a, a really positive experience. It's been great coming here. It's a great organization. Um, they've saved me in so many ways. I'm uh, insulin dependent and I didn't have any kind of medication and they have helped me through it within the last year, get myself back on track. And Hope Within has got me through a bunch of different things that I went through. The interactions here are amazing. The, the ladies that work here and the doctors are amazing. Just kindness, just total kindness is what this is all about.